Sylvia, or her full name, Sylvia Lena Cooper is a counter-type sniper class unit providing consistent damage output over time, stunning large groups of opponents from the backline, and is capable of unleashing sizable damage if kept away from enemy harassers long enough. She can be called to the field with 3 deployment points, making her one of the cheaper sniper units to deploy. Her core skills focus on dealing massive damage to clump units as well as stunning them for a long period of time, supporting mech units with buffs and dealing humongous amounts of damage if kept on the field long enough. Her passive skill increases hit and evasion of mech units by 20% and further increases attack at max level. Her special skill fires a ball of energy stunning mech units in the blast radius. If at max level, she can even stun soldiers and counters, as well as the stun lasting for 4 seconds. This is often maxed out first because of its high stun duration, as well as its large blast radius. Her ultimate lets her hack into a missile from Tactical Nuke Incoming What the f hacks into a missile and aims it right at the enemy's feet. The rocket will then slowly enter the field and hit the ground, dealing massive AoE damage. As a sniper unit that can easily stun all her opponents for large periods of time, as well as easily removing enemy snipers from the back, makes her a formidable sniper, not to mention a nuclear ultimate that can wipe a whole squad off the field. She will easily be the target of most enemy teams. With such high damage potential, she is taken back with her non-existent evasion and defense stats, making her the epitome of a glass cannon with damage coming literally off the charts, I mean like off the screen, and HP numbers as low as Kim So Bin whenever she spawns. You want to keep her away from enemy aggro, as well as safe from harasser units to maximize her skills. Although she is a glass cannon, her support should not be focused on healing or providing barriers because Sylvia will benefit more from damage increasing buffs, crit, attack speed, haste, and or hit in that respective order. Units providing debuffs to enemy defenses will also benefit her as lower defense of enemy units will in turn increase her damage potential. Of course, units that can offer heals will be more than welcome as healers are a staple in keeping team compositions alive throughout the fight. Defenders with long taunts and knockback skills will help clump together opponents and make an irresistible target for Sylvia to unleash her AoE stun and easily dispatch the whole squad. Mech units will have increased hit, evasion, and attack whenever you have Sylvia deployed. So best girl Tank Chan and Gundam Kun will be her best friends in every battle. Units such as Seo Yun to increase your damage for the duration of the fight will benefit the damage output for all her skills as well as benefiting your whole team. Debuffers like Beatrice will quickly execute strikers and defenders with low enough HP as well as debuff enemy defense and attack speed, paving the way for Sylvia to burst them down with relative ease. Remember that she is a soft unit that can melt almost any other unit and as such, PvE or PvP, her deployment should only be considered once threats are well enough away from her. Proper time of deployment will ensure your push into the enemy's base, while lackluster deployment will easily waste your deployment costs instead of getting another frontliner to hold the line for you. Relatively similar to her teams, her item stat priority should focus on having as much damage as possible as well as taking main stat and set bonuses that focus more on damage, crit, crit damage, or haste depending on whether you need more oomph, higher numbers, or more stun potential. Other stat bonuses should be on either resistance to enemy snipers or rangers only. Opting for resistance to strikers and defenders means that you are not holding your offensive properly. Ships are much less of a priority but are still subsidiary to improving either her survival or her damage. The Lake Superior can provide your team as well as Sylvia herself an extra hit against enemies and increase general tankiness for all of your units, while Kami Izumi will add to your offensive prowess in the field in the form of more crit and crit damage, as well as debuffing enemy units with their skill and ultimate. So choose whichever you are comfortable with and don't let me say otherwise. Her overall team composition should have a healthy mix 
of beefy defender units, preferably with taunts and knockbacks, strikers that can harass backline units, and rangers that can increase either attack speed or damage, as well as supports that debuff enemy teams and soften up opponents for her special skill to achieve its maximum potential. Sylvia Lena Cooper is a high damaging glass cannon sniper that can easily dispatch softer units and melt enemy frontline units with ease. Constantly stunning and providing AoE damage, she can easily destroy a full HP non-defender unit or wipe the entire enemy squad with her powerful burst attacks. Coupled with the proper supports and frontline damage sponges, as well as properly managing stats and substats of her equipment, she can easily control the battlefield with ease and ensure victory with just a few flicks of her fingertips. That's gonna be it for Sylvia's overview and general guide. Be sure to like and subscribe as well as clicking the bell icon to stay up to date for my next overview video. Comment down below on who do you think I should make an overview video for next. Alright, see ya! Bye!